Hi there. Now, for this first part of the question, then, you can see the answer to A was 4 and the answer to B was 80. So I'll take you through these if there were any problems. We were given then this sequence of terms, U1, U2, U3, and so on, and it was defined by this recurrence relationship here. The n plus 2 term, okay, in the sequence, Un plus 2, was equal to twice the n plus 1th term, Un plus 1, minus the nth term, Un, where n was greater than or equal to 1. So we were given this initial set of values here, u1 is 4 and u2 is 4. So in order to get u3, all you need to do is set n equal to 1 in this recurrence relationship. When n equals 1, you get u3 here, which is what we want, equals 2 lots of the second term, u1 add 1, u2, okay, minus u1, the first term. So all I've done is substitute those values for u2 and u1 in that we were given, and you end up with 2 times 4 minus 4, 8 minus 4, which is 4. And then in part b, here we've got to find the sum of the first 20 terms of this sequence, u, n, n going from 1 to 20. And it's always a good idea to list out in summations what it is you've got to find, in my opinion. In this case, u1 plus u2 plus and so on, all the way up to u20, the 20th term. So noticing that from here, u1 was 4, u2 was 4, u3 was 4, this was the clue for us that obviously all these terms, all 20 terms, are going to be 4. So I've got 4 20 times over. So 20 times 4 is 80. Okay?